Hey, hey, what's going on guys? Welcome to the Mealtime Show. Today we are doing the Tokyo Christmas Market. And there's a lot of food here. Let's go get some. Are we ready to eat? I think so. Check out this beautiful stash we've got. Stash, spread, what are we gonna call it? It's a Christmas party. That's what we're having, a Christmas party in Tokyo. No sushi, no curry, no noodles. Sausage and an onion flour to start. And we've got some cured ham here, cured meats. Look at that. Oh, gorgeous. Where are we going to start? Let's start with the kam pai, shall we? This is the black beer. Cheers, team. Get some to you. Merry Christmas. It feels holiday festive. That's a good beer. German, I believe. It comes from this shop, number 27. Yep, Carlsberg. Beautiful, huh? They have got lots of food stands here, 29 total. That's a lot of food. All right, speaking of food, let's get into it, shall we? I think this is the hors d'oeuvre right here. Look at that. In, in Japanese, they call this namahamba, cured ham. It's beautiful. Can I get it into a smaller piece? I believe this is two pieces. One in. Mmm. Oh. That's mighty fine. Prosciutto, that's what it is. And it looks like we got a couple different types here. I'll try this one. Mmm, this is a lighter meat. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's good. That's really tasty. And what else? We've got some salami here. Some good flavor there. Nice. Very nice. And you can keep the Tupperware. How about that? Okay, moving on to the onion flour they're calling this. Beautiful presentation. It comes apart so easily. It's very fragile. And it looks like ketchup on the inside there. They also had mayonnaise at the counter, but I thought, no, nah, let's just do it with the ketchup. Mmm. Oh, that is tasty. And it goes good with the ketchup. No mayonnaise necessary. And those of you who watch my videos, you know I am a mayonnaise lover. 
But this is good. The, the batter is light. Mm hmm. Light, flaky. The onions got a nice flavor. This is really good. Sometimes the coating on onion rings is just too thick, but this is just right. Mm. And the onion is sliced nice and thin. This is gorgeous. Can't stop eating it. Half of it's gone already. Get in there, guys. Take a bite of the onion flour. Woohoo! We are getting some. Okay, we've got another drink here. Comes in this beautiful mug. You get to keep the mug. Gorgeous. Tokyo Christmas Market. So a spicy hot wine. It's like lemon. Not sure. Oh. Oh boy. It tastes really strong. That is a nice wine. Sweet and spicy. Interesting. It tastes really strong though. Like high alcohol content. Goodness. Soothing as it goes down your throat. Definitely warms up the body. Yeah. Okay, and now we've got some sausage over here. German sausage, yo. Didn't get a knife to cut it with, but we'll just, this one's already kind of sliced in the middle there. Get some hot mustard to put on top of it here. We're not gonna dip it. You don't get that much. Okay, so three different types of sausages. This looks like the herb sausage here first. Mm. That's all right. That's all right, indeed. No spice to that one at all. I mean, no heat. This one, this should be a little spicy. I like a little bit of spice to my sausage. Oh, this one's tougher. More meaty. Mm-hmm. But not too much spice. I just like how this one chews, the texture. Mm-hmm. All right, and the last one, maybe this will be the spicy one. I'm hoping there's at least one spicy one. Adding the mustard is going to help, I think. Oh, yeah. And this one's the best. I saved the best for last. It's got cheese in it. Oh. Cheese and some spice. I think I ate them in the proper order. Mm -hmm. Oh, and that black beer. They call it black beer in Japan, dark beer, but because of the color, obviously. It's nice. Next up is shop number 17, Polinaire. Forgot to get their beer, but we got their food. Yeah. All right, it's very bright out here. Sunglasses? Let's do no sunglasses. Okay, so three items here. We got the fish and chips, the garlic shrimp, and this is the goulash served inside of a roll, a soup roll. Fish and chips? Okay. We'll do the tartar sauce. How does that look? So-so. The preparation was very quick. 
Mm. It's a bit on the tough side, but nice taste. Nice taste. Mm -hmm. Going for the chips. Who eats chips with chopsticks? Nobody. Just me. The chips or fries are really good. Mm -hmm. Let's go for another piece of fish. See if it's any different. Nope, it's the same. Stuffed. Okay, next up, the garlic shrimp. You get a lot. It's a pretty good portion. It's glistening. It looks really nice. Oh, it's very garlicky. I like how you, the tail is really soft. You just eat the whole thing. The shell is very soft. And it's good meaty shrimp. Tasty. Okay, let's go in for this. The main event here. This guy. It's the stew, beef stew, I believe. Oh, look at that. Huge chunk of beef right there. That. I have to cut that. Looks like some broccoli. What is that, a pepper? Oh, goodness. All right, let's do the veggies first, shall we? Vegetables first. Whoa. Oh, that gravy. This is really tasty. Oh, my goodness. Mmm. Wow, the flavor of this is so rich. So, so rich. Let's see if I can cut into this a little bit. I can grab a knife, but oh, look at that. It just, with the spoon, just cuts through it like butter with a spoon, huh? Look at that, the stew, beef stew, here goes. That is fabulous, wow. Let's get some of the peppers here. I like these little yellow peppers. Mmm. <laughs> Bit of a carrot. Mmm. This cake is called Shitoren, and it looks like a fruit cake, European fruit cake. Comes with this cream. It's pretty hefty, weighty, thick. Mm. Oh, that's solid. It's a hefty fruit cake. Wow, that's really good. It's really dense, and the cream's nice, too. Mm. Oh, it is good. Served nicely chilled. Wow. And what is it? There's nuts in it, too? Kind of tastes like dates or something. Not sure what kind of fruit it is, but it's pretty delicious. Mm-hmm. Mm. -hmm. mm. It's also got powdered sugar on top. That is just packed with fruit, with dried fruit. 
We're going for a black coffee here to finish off with. Oh, that's a rich coffee. Oh, it's strong. Woo! But good, in a good way. All right, so that's gonna do it for the Christmas festival in Tokyo, guys. What did you guys think, huh? The food was pretty good. Pretty good, it's a very festive environment here. I enjoyed it, yeah. So overall, I think for my rating, I'm gonna give it a five out of six today. Five of the Eric heads. So I wanna thank you guys for watching and we'll see you in the next one.